Skeletons, it is Disney Queen Skelly here, and don't I look like 10 times better than I did last night? <laughs> Sorry about that. It's because I actually put my face on today. And it's like I promised, um, today I'm going to be just be reading you a few facts about Steamboat Willie um, that I found online. And I wrote them down because, hey! Last time I did fun facts, I was just reading them online, and it didn't exactly work, because I kept, like, stumbling on what I was saying. So I think, like, me writing it down makes it, like, ten times easier <laughs> than it would be. So, I like to read it online, because, like, you don't know what you're reading, and I feel like if you, like, read something twice, it sticks in your head a little bit better. So, um, alright, let's get down to it. Maybe I'll end up reading some, some facts that you guys actually didn't know about the movie. So, Steamboat Willie facts. Before the copyright for Steamboat Willie expired, was set to expire in 2003. Disney lobbied the U.S. Congress successfully for an extension of copyright protection by 20 years. Because of this law, Steamboat Willie will not enter the public domain until 2023. Oh, pardon me, I'm a little sick. <laughs> My nose starts running, ugh. Anyone else sick? You know, that time of year again, raise your hand if you're sick, you know. Put a thumbs up if you're sick in the comments. <laughs> Alright. Steamboat Willie debuted at the Colony Theater on Broadway on November 18th, 1928. Felix the Cat animator Hat Walker is quoted in John Kane Maker's Felix the Twisted Tale of the World's Most Famous Cat saying that Disney put us out of business with his sound. Steamboat Willie is actually not the first synchronized sound cartoon. Walt Disney's rival Max Fleischer, 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 one of those, <laughs> had produced a series of sound, s series of sound, bouncing ball song cartoons, which featured synchronized dialogue and music starting in 1926. The first to be produced was My Old Kentucky Home. On Steamboat Willie's release, this cartoon was paired with the movie was paired with the movie Gang War, but it was this cartoon, not the main movie that movie patrons walked away talking about. One scene that was planned but never animated was the loading dock. After Mickey loaded the cow onto the boat, he was to have loaded the sow and her piglets as well. Steamboat Willie is one of the six cartoons that plays the main that plays in the Main Street Cinema at Disneyland. Actually, it's like one of my favorite places to go. It's so cool in there. Variety's review of Steamboat Willie read, Not the first animated cartoon to be synchronized with sound effects, but the first to attract favorable attention. This one represents a high order of cartoon ingenuity, cleverly combined with sound effects. The union brought laughs galore. Giggles came so fast at the colony, they were stumbling over each other. Variety, November 21st, 1928. And those are just a few fun facts I found about the movie Steamboat Willie. Or, I guess the animated short Steamboat Willie. <laughs> one of the two, right? <laughs> All right, well, thank you guys so much for watching, and as I promised, tomorrow is going to be Santa's workshop. Um, if I can't find anything on on Santa's workshop, um, I'll most likely just do um, a ride from Disneyland that I haven't done yet, and I think the only ones I have done are Haunted Mansion, Snow White, and Pinocchio, if I remember correctly. I'll have to look back, but, um, yeah, I'll just, if I can't find anything on the, sh on the short Santa's workshop, I'll just do, like, a Disney ride. Alright, guys, so thank you so much for watching. I will see you tomorrow. Bye, my little skeletons.